When we first moved to Burke Street, it was bleak. Fast moving through traffic, cars, dusty, asphalt footpaths, asphalt parks, cyclone wiring. The Greek mothers were the ones who signed my petition about getting improvements in, in Burke Street. And I, I took the petition up to Burke Street School. And now, Burke Street is a wonderful environment for families. Children can now cycle to school. As a, an independent in the city, I take up issues for the community that the big parties don't want to know about. For example, taking a stand for the gay and lesbian community, going in Mardi Gras back there in the early 90s when the mainstream party simply didn't want to know. In the last parliament, there was one conscience vote, and that was on my private member's bill to allow same-sex couples to adopt the children that they had fostered. I was just really concerned about our musicians not having uh, an opportunity. Poker machines killed live music. I put a uh, private member's bill to parliament. We now have 36 bars in Sydney, and musicians have a, a chance. Part of our way of addressing climate change and reducing congestion is to create separated, safe cycleways. We've already built Woolloomooloo to Waterloo. We've already built the Harbour Bridge to Anzac Bridge. So people will be able to move across the city. Defending our parkland has been a very important part of my, my political life. An open space is just sacred. It should be an absolute no-go area for, for governments, and yet we're constantly fighting to, to keep it and look after it. We are taking action to reduce our emissions by 70% by 2030. We have a plan for Sydney. We need a plan in our state. Our federal government needs a plan. Now more than ever, we need strong leadership from governments, but we need real champions, independent champions in our parliament to make sure the government does have a plan for our future to ensure we get the action that we need here in Sydney. Every vote has to be an informed vote. Every vote has to be based on the merits of the case and the principle, and it has to be a conscience vote. And I think that's the difference between being an independent and a member of a political party. And I, I would never be prepared to sacrifice that. Authorised by Ian Black, 8 Chelsea Street, Redfern. Spoken by Clever Moore.